When I was like 10, my stepdad sexually abused me. And then that's when I went and told the police. And then that's when I came into the system. Um, before Boys Town, I was in multiple foster homes with my two younger brothers. Mike Tasia has come from a background where she, she had to grow up too fast. She had to um, deal with people in her life who weren't always concerned about her best interest. I just remember Mike being very um, guarded and just not really wanting to trust anyone um, and just really concerned of where she had to watch her back, um, especially just being violated by somebody in her own home. Being in Boy Sound, I actually played a lot of sports and I made like all the teams that I actually went to. I tried track which I never did before, and it turned out to be fun. And basketball, I never touched the basketball before I came to Boys Town, and it's just been a fun experience playing for them for the past four seasons. It taught me how to be a leader, and I never wanted to be a leader, or I never thought of myself as being a leader until coming to Boys Town. It's amazing to watch them bloom into just amazing people, and Mike Tasia is one of those girls who, um, I don't think she believed that she was a real strong girl um, deep down. Um, and then by her growing into that girl and being strong, and it's amazing the character and the person that they just feel safe to become. And that's definitely Mike Tasia. I plan to like study law and try to play basketball in college. All those people who told her she wasn't going to be able to do it or or uh, maybe you shouldn't set those dreams so high that, that, that might be a little bit tough um, I'm excited to see Mike prove them wrong um, because she has that talent she has that ability um, and she has that drive to be able to go and and do whatever she wants to do